Steam Series, championed by your Southern California Toyota dealers. Every week we're celebrating people making a difference with STEAM careers. Today's focus is math and engineering. And CBS2 meteorologist Amber Lee takes us inside the lab of a professor of mechanical engineering. A logarithmic spiral. These kids in this room are the brightest of their generation. We can essentially turn on a zero radius. This is the Mechanical Engineering Design Lab at the California Institute of Technology. It's one of the toughest classes at one of our nation's most selective universities. We don't go for second place. You go for first, you go to win. Professor of Mechanical Engineering Michael Mello is guiding teams of students as they prepare for competition. And they've had to develop amphibious vehicles. We took the Toyota Mobile Weather Lab out to Caltech to see how Dr. Mello is preparing the next generation of robotics innovators. Not only do they mechanically fabricate a robot, they have to come up with ways to digitally communicate with the robot. In this class, teams of students have to do it all. Their assignment, create robots from scratch that can shoot balls and retrieve them while moving through the campus pond. I don't care what your widget is, you need to devise a widget that is going to withstand the rigors of the environment that it is meant to live in. The team that scores the most points by hitting their targets will win. Throughout the design and building process, there are plenty of tough decisions, like speed versus accuracy. Also, materials that may be easy to fabricate could break when a robot goes fast. A scissor lift like this, which has a shooting advantage, could topple if it's windy. Dr. Mello says dealing with these dilemmas are great practice for real world careers. What we want to produce are engineers that enter the world understanding the challenges to actually translate a design into something real. Innovators who understand as they design a product. What dimensional accuracy can I reasonably attain? What can I expect a machinist one day to do for me? Of all the STEAM disciplines, successful robot creation relies most on engineering and math. We never can get away from those foundational courses. Dr. Mello says it's the mathematical formulas that help mechanical engineers see the future. That's the foundation, right, of why things fail. As these students work to perfect and predict how well the robots will perform in competition, Dr. Mello is working to make sure he's doing his job, pushing these future captains of innovation and industry to realize every bit of their extraordinary potential. And there's an enormous obligation to these kids that I feel every day. It keeps me up at night. Many students in the program have gone on to work in robotics for companies like JPL and NASA. For more on STEAM careers, go to cbsla.com steam.